Hey friends, I am so excited to come to you on this Monday because I've had this moment of brilliance. Instead of doing past events and talking about them after they happen, I thought on Mondays I would give you guys a heads up on all of the cool things happening in Atlanta so that you can get there and join in on the fun. So let's start with this weekend. Uh, June 7th brings a very cool concert to Aaron's Amphitheater at Lakewood, and that's Zach Brown Band. Enough said. He is fantastic, and if you want to have a wonderful time outdoors, hopefully the weather will be as beautiful as it is today, you can go hear some chill music and celebrate living life with Zach Brown Band. The show starts at 7 p.m. It's a great way to spend your Saturday night. Moving on to the Strong for Life Superhero Sprint. It's sponsored by Children's Healthcare of Atlanta. It's a great event for so many reasons. Let's start with just dressing like a superhero. Who doesn't want to be a superhero? Oh my gosh, if I was going to run in this event, first of all, because it is a 5K sprint, I would be the Flash because obviously he is super fast, and I would like to consider myself the same. He's also spry from what I could tell by watching the TV show when I was a kid. So I think him and I are pretty much the same person. Now that 5K starts at 8.30 a.m., but there's so much going on. There's a one mile fun run. There's also a costume contest at 10.15. Hopefully they'll give away some gift cards with that. Now this whole event is to help childhood obesity and all of the diseases that are associated with that. And I believe that's a great cause to get out and help your community and also such a, such a great way to help children. That's, you know, our youth, that's our future. So why not spend your Saturday <laughs> being a superhero and running? And if you're not planning on running, donate. I'll put the link up. You can absolutely support a runner or donate money for such a great cause. And if nothing else, go out there and watch superheroes do their thing. Enough said on that too. All right, moving on, there's also Shakespeare in the Park. This is my cheat sheet. There's also Shakespeare in the Park on Saturday. They are performing the play As You Like It. It's their first weekend of the season. <laughs> you can get out there, it's on the lawn at Piedmont Park. Take a blanket, some vino maybe, great food and hors d'oeuvres. Willie's is right down, get a big old burrito, you know, take the burrito to the park, munch on that, enjoy some bluegrass music before the show starts. There is music before every show all summer long, and listen to some Shakespeare. How merry, it's a merry occasion to go and eat your food, drink your wine, and watch some Shakespeare. I think that's a great idea. It's something great to do. Link will go up, you can join in on the fun. And last but not least, where most of my friends will be this weekend, is the Virginia Highlands Summerfest. Now, my best girlies often go over there, rent bikes, and ride up and down the street on their bikes. There's food vendors, there's an artist market, everything from photography to metalworks and sculptures and jewelry. You could pretty much spend your whole paycheck there, I'm sure, because prices vary, so I'm sure some things are pretty inexpensive, going all the way up to maybe not some so inexpensive. <laughs> uh, but go there, there's vendors, food vendors, all the way down the street. Friday and Saturday night, they're having street parties with acoustic music. And 105.7 has also joined in the fun, and they have done a vote for a local artist who will be performing at the acoustic stage for Summerfest. I love acoustic music, and to support your local artists, I mean, Atlanta is so huge now. We all know that, between actors and musicians. Get out to Summerfest, enjoy non-alcoholic and alcoholic beverages, Great food, fun, artist market, rent a bike, and ride up and down the street. Summerfest is where it's at. Each of these events will be put up online, and you can, not online, each of these events will be put up at the end of this blog. There's a link to them so you can do your own research and figure out if and when you can go. All right, guys, that is my first weekend update for the weekend of June 7th. I hope that this is helpful so you guys can get out and have some fun this weekend and have some for me. But I will be packing for the beach. That is where I will be. Maybe I will send you an aloha video of what it looks like from my perspective. Enjoy the week, guys. Take care of yourselves. And until next time, this is Beth coming to you with a local lens of Atlanta. Take care of yourselves.